Hello everyone, let's start with a new video of Marketplace Business Directory for Magento. This module is highly beneficial for the Marketplace users as after installation, admin gives a unique feature to the seller to add business directories uh, to their profile. Also, admin can create different categories of the sellers in which admin can easily set limits to add business directory for the sellers also admin can uh, set check on duration of the subscription and uh, the recurring profile can be done by the paypal payment gateway so to manage this module we have to log into our admin panel so this is our demo admin panel admin have to go to system configuration so under system configuration uh, there will be a marketplace menu and under marketplace menu there is mp business direct so under mp business directory the first field is select root category so admin can easily select the root category for the business directory listing and then uh, the next field is select page layout so admin can easily select page layout as per the requirement now the directory approval required admin can set it as yes and admin can set it as no and then admin email id so here admin can enter the email id now allow seller to add directory limited and unlimited admin can select among them uh, after that number of add directory so here admin can easily uh, set a number of add directory now the check on only admin can uh, set check on them only number of products or only time or time and number of product both and after that admin can save the configuration from this button now admin have to go to a general design and admin have to enter the themes admin can easily write business underscore directory in these fields after that admin can save the configuration from uh, this button so that's all for the admin configuration part now admin can easily view the business directory menu under the marketplace management so here is mp business directory and uh, here will be three menus business di uh, directory classifieds uh, reasons and manage group for directory so at first we will enter to business directory classifieds so these are the existing classifieds of the business directory and here is the id uh, name owner name and name of the company and the status approved or unapproved and admin can click on any existing business directory uh, and uh, can view the reports claims and contacts of uh, the listing admin can easily select any a listing and uh, can do action unapprove or approve in bulk so that's all for the directories part now we will move to the reasons so here are the directory report reasons admin can add new reasons from here so admin can write the reason here and admin can select enable or disable the reason from uh, this drop down and by saving the reason it will be saved so we have saved the reason 
so here the reason is displayed admin can easily edit the reason from by clicking on the reason or admin can easily delete the reason from here so here is the success message that one record were successfully deleted so that's all for the reason part now we will move to the manage group for directory so here admin can easily create or manage the groups of the sellers to list the categories in the marketplace so here are the three existing groups silver gold and platinum admin can easily click on any group to edit this group or modify the group so here is the group name and the number of products allowed now the fee amount in currency now status enable disable so admin can easily enable or disable this group from here now the schedule here is the schedule description here is the billing period duration and the initial fees if admin set the initial fees as yet as yes then uh, seller have to first uh, deposit the initial fees and then they can start using the marketplace now associate recurring profile admin can easily set the recurring profile from here and after that admin can save the group uh, from this button so all the modification have been uh, saved so that's how admin can easily edit a group and admin can also add any group from this add button and admin have to fill all the required information uh, regarding the group and admin have to enter the schedule of the group and then admin can easily save the group from this save button so that's all for the admin management part now we will uh, move to our front end so here is our front end you can view the directories uh, listed in the marketplace at first we will discuss about the seller account so we will log into our seller account so here we have logged into our demo sellers account and uh, under marketplace menu there is a menu for the add directory manage list and pay directory group fee so we will go to add directory so here is a page where a seller can easily add a directory and here is the message please wait for a billing cycle payment so right now the seller have not been cleared the billing cycle payment so that's why uh, these buttons are disabled and whenever a seller will pay the billing cycle amount the these buttons will be enabled so so we will discuss the payment after this step now here seller have to uh, enter the company name contact person email of the listing and then the address of uh, the directory like street postcode city and country you can select any country from here now after selecting the pin code and country the longitude and la uh, latitude will be displayed here so so here you can see i have entered an address and here it has displayed the longitude and latitude and uh, it has displayed the location of the listing so that's how the it will display the location of the listing uh, uh, you, by using the Google map now here is the phone number and fax then the website title after that seller can easily select business days or working days
from here and after that seller can easily uh, write the description of the listing after that the short description and here is company logo seller can easily select any company logo from here also a seller can add more images uh, for the company and after that a seller can easily uh, save the listing from this button so that's all for adding a directory listing to the marketplace now we will move to my directory list so here you can see the existing uh, directory list and seller can easily edit any uh, directory or seller can easily delete any directory uh, from here seller can also delete directories by selecting the directories and by clicking on delete directories button but i'll not delete any uh, directory so i'll show you how seller can easily edit any business directory so here seller can easily edit any business directory uh, here is the company name contact person email then the address details seller can select the uh, business directory category here is the location now the phone number and fax and website title and here is the business days now the description again the short description and the company logo so that's how the seller can easily modify uh, the business directory and uh, by clicking on the save button the directory will be saved so that's all for the directory list part so by clicking on the pay group fee menu uh, seller can easily select group any group from here and the group uh, details will be displayed here like if we select the silver group then the group fee amount is different and number of product allowed is different and if we select platinum uh, the number of product allowed different and amount is different and seller can pay uh, by clicking on this pay button uh, this will redirect the seller to the PayPal website. So here we have redirected. So here we have redirected to our PayPal website. So from here, uh, seller can easily log in and pay the group fee. So that's how seller can easily. Add directory, uh, manage directory, and pay directory group fee. So here we have entered the uh, category business directory. So here all the directory uh, is been listed. So customer can easily search by clicking on uh, the alphabet, or customer can easily search by this uh, search keyword and customer can extend uh, the search so that's how customer can easily extend uh, the search and uh, search for the business directory so that's how the business directory works I hope you have understood how admin can easily configure the uh, marketplace business directory from the admin panel and how admin can manage the business directory groups from the admin panel and how seller can easily add, manage and pay the business directory group fee from the seller panel and how customer can easily search for the business directory. So thank you for watching this video. Stay connected.